What is up everybody? Today we're going to be doing the Nod version of No Harv MG into Mammoth. It's going to be No Harv Nod into Avatar. This of course is going to be much worse uh, because No Harv Nod is uh, doesn't have the ability to win the first missile without spending a lot of money I think. Like No Harv GDI that you can get away with it because you can win the first missile while spending like 100 Tiberium. Which is uh, is very good. The so nod, I, if you build, you have to build two buildings, kind of realistically, to do uh, to do no half, and that's going to cost you seventy just in the building costs, and then it's going to be really difficult for you to actually get to the harvester. That's the problem. You can win the first missile, but then you're not going to be able to afford a harvester afterwards. So that's really where the issue arises with no half not into avatar. But we'll see how it goes. Like, we need to try and save a reasonable amount of money for as long as possible. If we win this missile here without any more problems, then we'll be fine. Because we can afford the harvester right away. Alright, looks like we're going to be good. Now we go double half, and then we go avatar. Also, avatar is, like, less powerful than mammoth. Like, you're less likely to win a game because you made an avatar. Mammoth is basically unbeatable. Well, not, maybe not anymore because it's garbage now, but, you know, it used to be, like, basically unbeatable. I should be stalling these pads as well, given that we're now going double half. Where, where are you going, Harvester? What's up, Tiger? Go, Tigers! We are not close to our avatar. Not even a little bit. He also has an orca, which means we have to go phantom before we can realistically make the avatar. That's a little awkward. Yeah, looks like we're going to lose this missile. It's not super surprising to lose the second missile. Since we went double half. We're gonna have to get this phantom now to protect our harvester. Yeah, we're just not even close to the avatar still. <laughs> and we are gonna need an avatar reasonably soon. I mean, we're like two minutes into the game and we're still not close to an avatar. It's like 2.30 we might get an avatar. Oh, well. That's probably a good thing that he iron cannon that because now he can't iron cannon my avatar. Although I do need another phantom, so I'm actually going to hang back with the avatar because he's definitely going to make uh, Orca. There it is. Ooh, avatar just goes down so easily, man. It just only takes like three or four Orca volleys to kill an avatar. Which is like, if you think about it, as long as you can get the volley off with the Orca, three, three Orcas is about the same price as an avatar. It's actually slightly cheaper. So if you can just volley an avatar to death with Orcas, it's kind of an efficient trade. Which is nuts. Okay. Feeling good about my no half chances against Shah. Probably shouldn't have built the barracks. I mean, like, if he makes missiles, I'm going to need the barracks, but he's not like guaranteed to do that, so didn't necessarily need to build it. I could also just spam wheels in the early game. That might work out. Get a laser. We're almost certainly going to need a laser here. What do you think his air unit is? Normally it's Orca, but isn't Orca going to be way too slow for the first missile? It's Talon, weirdly. Okay. Should not have made these bikes, because this is going to slow down my harvester dramatically. Yeah, that was a huge misplay. I didn't need these bikes at all. And now my harvester is delayed by like 20 seconds or something. It's something crazy like that. Like getting 10 Tiberium in the early game takes an incredibly long time without a harvester. 
I think it is. It's like two Tiberium a second, so it's five seconds, I think. So it's ten seconds to get uh get that twenty Tiberium, which is crazy when you think about it, considering the length of a game of Rivals. Oh, I should have made a second harvester there. Good choice, lasers. The missile trooper seems like the relevant threat there. We've got ourselves another Orca player. No surprises, everyone plays Orca. Get our second half. Might just win the game without even uh, getting to the avatar. I guess we should, uh, we should, you know, not win this missile if we look like we're going to. Oh, oh, oh. oh, all right, almost, almost flubbed it. <laughs> almost flubbed it, boys. <laughs> Wasn't gonna be able to get my avatar out there. So predictable, knowing talent. All right, now let's get the avatar. And we're going to need a phantom as well. Wow, that is an interesting turret. The game's almost over. I've only just got my avatar, the game's almost over. Super units are very bad in rivals. Like, tech in general is just so slow. Alright, bulk camp. Avatar's almost dead as well. Avatar is just a bad unit now, isn't it? It's just a really bad unit. Mission accomplished. Battlefield control. Three, two, one. New objective received. Alright, let's see if we can just barracks. I mean, war factory. If we can just spam wheels and win the first missile, that'd be sweet. I think he's going straight into War Factory. The problem is if he goes War Factory and I have to make bikes, which is what's going to happen. Bikes are so expensive. Like trying to trying to win a bike mirror without a harvester is is kind of insane. I'm trying to get him to shoot my wheels, he wasn't having any of it. Looks like we could get the first missile here. Depends if these, these bikes can't fire twice, can they? Alright, so we did manage to get to it. We did manage to get the first missile with just War Factory. Now we have to defend against a bunch of bikes, though, and we also need the money for a second harvester. Which I guess. Are we doing that right away? No, we can't. There's no way. We'll just die. We'll just lose our harvester to his bike spam if we try and do that. We have to go lasers. Probably gonna lose the harvester anyway, even after going laser. Fight good unit, confirmed. Hemoria? Oh my god. This guy really wants his harvester. He's a rivals player. You can tell. Never getting my second harvester. <laughs> Literally never getting my second harvester. I don't even want to win this missile, I just wanna just wanna stall. Alright, we get the second harvester. I don't think these fights are getting back on this pad. Oh, okay. Not really expecting to win that missile, to be fair. Now let's see if we can make it to the Avatar. We're actually not super far away from the Avatar. We are at like 2 minute 30 already. We do need to save our boost to dodge Jade missile, though. Hmm. This is going to be kind of tough to throw a Gabe missile on this, uh, yeah, here we go. 
Alright, cool, we dodged it easily. Mutants to fight Avatar, that's an aggressive plan. Mutants and Stealth Tank to fight Avatar. I don't know how well mutants do against Avatar, but I don't want to send the Avatar in first just in case the mutants are surprisingly good. Alright, easy. Mow these guys down as well. Alright, Avatar OP. No half Avatar. The strongest stratagem. Avatar War Mech. Objective complete. Three, two, one. New objective available. Oh no, I built Harvester. Whoops. Uh, I don't know what to do now. <laughs> do I just do I just play Avatar? I guess. Yeah, I guess we just play uh, play Avatar, don't I? This is kind of awkward. Well, not sure we can beat Pitbull, to be perfectly honest with you. Pitbull seems like a real beating. Pitbull and Shock Trooper. The nightmare begins. Uh, <laughs> so dead. Yeah, well, I'm definitely losing this missile. We double harbor and we can't beat a Pitbull. We're like not super far off Avatar though. Alright, Poggers. Don't have to worry about uh, Iron Cannon. Here comes a Mohawk. I've already got lasers though. And obviously, he was going to make something like that. Alright, I don't think we lose right now, we have this avatar. Get the phantom, I suppose. It's not great against the mobile, so... Yeah, get that half, son. If only you had another 80 tier, but then you'd be able to beat two avatars. My Phantom is just so not very good against Mohawk. <laughs> it's kind of, uh, it's kind of sad. Such is the nature of rivals, the way units match up against each other is so important. Here comes the Desperation Drone Spam. A classic rivals maneuver. Alright, that was my bad. My bad for going uh, Harvester there. Enemy base destroyed. Establishing battlefield control. 
Your rival's account is US? Okay. <laughs> you CJ? It's not CJC though, it's CJ3212. Looks like we're going to see a war factory. No, no war factory. Let's get third wheel. There's the war factory. I guess we'll get laser. Let's do wheel and laser for first missile. Alright, that's first missile, and we have the almost have the 60 tip, feels good. We do need to also be able to defend our harvester though. Just every rival player on the planet, man. Literally every rival player on the planet. Ooh, Chuggy. Chuggy is very bad news for us. Chuggy is just an extremely powerful unit. I need that second harvester ASAP. I like how the Chuggy like barely touched my lasers, but because it puts down the cloud after like half a second, that's it. Getting lower. Oh, that's gonna be a problem. It's Chuggy Giga. That's, uh, that's gonna be a big problem. We don't have any outs to this. And he's gonna farm our harvesters as well. Yeah, I don't know about this one, man. This one might be a loss. I don't think we can ever beat a Giga Cannon. That unit is way too good. Well, we did kill the Giga, but we don't really want to win this missile. We want to go Avatar. We're just kind of, well, never mind. <laughs> don't have to worry about that. Never winning the missile against Giga and Chuggy. <laughs> Didn't have to worry about winning that missile. Alright, well, the good news is that Giga Cannon gets dumped on pretty hard by Avatar. Maybe. So maybe once we get to Avatar, we can defeat the, uh, the, the heinous Giga that everyone hates. If we ever make it to Avatar, we're actually pretty close. We can probably do next unit Avatar. Avatar is real good against bikes as well because it attacks so quickly. It doesn't have the problem that Mammoth has where it takes too long to kill bikes. Avatar War Mech! Alright, GG. GG, Avatar repeat. Love watching a Giga Cannon get absolutely Shrek. It's one of my favourite things. Giga Cannon and Artillery. I just love watching them get annihilated. I prefer not Harry. Alright, here we go. The no half dream. You really like my new haircut? Thank you, Satana. I appreciate that. I get it cut specifically for the viewers of the stream, so it's nice of you to notice. Not sure we needed the barracks here to be honest, given the way the game was going. Wow, a boost? That is a bad boost. I'm just gonna build the half now. I feel like our oh, no half. We've won the first missile with no half here, quite obviously. Yeah, Banshee, that ought to do it. <laughs> That'll solve all your problems. The second half is not harvested yet. Not even a little bit. Oh, there we go. Finally got on there. Boost to kill the wheels? That seems really aggressive. 
I guess he's annoyed at those wheels. That's understandable. Oh, I haven't got my second half yet. Whoops. I thought I got my second half ages ago. Alright, my bad, chat. My bad. I was wondering why I had so little money. Because I never actually built my second harvester. Feels like a tough one to get to get to Avatar. Oh, Miss Home Baker. <laughs> Excellent. Well, that's unfortunate. It's a sad day for Baco. Baco? I don't know how you pronounce that. Oh, he's got the list. Uh oh. Look out, boys. He's got the basilisk. Alright, Basilisk down, no problem. No problem, boys. No half avatar OP. Mission accomplished. Field control. Three, two, one. New mission received. Building online. Unit ready. Right, a harvester. Strong, strong start. Air tower? Hmm, don't like the sound of that. Razorback first unit, that one deserves an emote. That one definitely deserves an emote. That is a surreal first unit, man. What a wild ride this game has been. I, I feel reasonably confident in this game. I feel like I could win this one. Something tells me. Grenadier? Come on, man. Be reasonable. There's an outrageous unit to make. Alright, we got a harvest to kill and two harvesters. How quickly can we get an avatar? Unit offline. Toyka ready to roll. Advancing. I have not yet lost Coffee Cat. Alright, there we go. Avatar almost just under two minutes. That is a that is a rapid avatar. Man, it'd be a real shame if these friends couldn't beat my avatar. Sad. Sad day for Grenadiers. Although, what day has not been a sad day for Grenadiers, to be fair? All days that Grenadiers have existed have been sad days for Grenadiers. Zool. It's your boy, Zool. Wheels and lasers. All you need, son. Oh, that's a bike squadron. Uh, I should maybe make my own bikes. I don't know. I think I'm going to try the wheels and lasers since he opened bikes as well. It's so hard to ever catch a bike squadron, you know? He really wants this wheel squadron to die. He's like heavily invested in it. Oh, is he going to get it? Oh, we did it. Very nice. Heavily invested in that one. That's a chemical body. Oh, we're dead. Rip. 
I mean, not like definitely 100% Giga dead, but yeah, that's real bad. Because you see our Tiberium is also at 10. So even if we win this missile, which we might, it's not even like a guarantee at the moment, we might win it. Looks like we're probably going to. Uh, we can't afford the Harvester for ages, which is a real big problem. Yeah, we're going to take a long time. And even, even when we get the Harvester, it's hard to defend it because he has Bites and Chuggy. And we have to defend with Laser and laser and Bite. But we do have to build the Harvester, that's like absolutely a requirement. Otherwise we're just going to get beaten because we never have any money. Now we have to fight on massively on the back foot. Until uh, until we can afford a second harvester, we'll probably lose this harvester because we're so far behind from having to spend the sixty on building it. Yeah, it looks like we lose it for sure. Maybe not for sure. Does it live? It lives. It lives, chat. It lives. That's good number one. Now this is actually a pretty good, pretty good spot for us. This is not so bad. We're gonna lose that harvester, but we already have both up and running, so it's fine. Like we don't get pushed off the map, which is the thing that's dangerous. Oh wow, he already has cyborgs. That's a yikes. I wonder when he got his second harvester. I wonder if it was. I mean, he must have got it a while back, right? Killing one harvester does not get you cyborgs. Alright, we're really going to need our avatar here. We are some way away from being able to build it. Actually not that far off being able to build it now. Just need to lose a unit and then we can build it. Maybe that unit could be my harvester. Oh, it's an avatar mirror. That is spicy. This is actually really bad because I just used my boost. Obviously, the boost is huge in an avatar mirror. Alright, we're going in, boys. We're going in. Easy win. Avatar mirror king. Let's go. Easy victory. Why don't you just, why don't you just surrender, Zul? Why don't you just accept defeat to the avatar god? The god of avataring. That's me, by the way, in case anyone's wondering. Avatar God! God of Avatars! Da, 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 da. Control and inspire! Well, no, we motivated the masses instead. I actually feel real bad for doing that emote, because now I feel like Big Boss, who was just one of the... Just, just an awful human being. <laughs> just a very, thoroughly unpleasant person. No, I did it again! Chat, honestly. Because I get distracted during the wait period and I forget what I'm doing. Ah, that feels bad, man. What do I do here? I'm gonna wait until I've made some money off of this harvester and then I'm gonna... I was gonna say that I'm gonna lose the harvester and play no half, but by that point the first missile will have fired and it'll be too late to... to go back to no half. Ah, I'm just dumb is the problem. I'm a very forgetful person. Use half to back pad. Okay, but then I'm down 60 tier and I auto lose the missile. Like, you can't win with no harv after spending 60 Diverium on a harvester. <laughs> like, a harvester is not a good unit to spend 60 tip on if you're trying to win a missile. So I don't really think that's a solution. That's just, uh, that's just gonna make me lose. I think the best solution is just to just to, to play Avatar and be sad. Be sad that we messed up for the second time. We actually also like this guy went this guy had a boar factory opening into Chuggy. We might have actually lost this first missile. If we didn't have a harvester, this might have been our first actual loss. Hmm, Flamers is, Flamers is a bit of a problem. 
Yeah, I'm definitely looks like we lose this missile. Well, he's buying us a lot of time. No, we're still gonna lose it. Let's kick a chuggy. Yeah, we definitely would have we've been screwed first missile about a half a step. But now we get to melt a Giga Cannon with Avatar, which is one of the best things in the game. Certainly newsworthy. <laughs> yeah, second Giga ought to do the job. <laughs> oh man, that second Giga just got absolutely murdered. Getting pretty confident in this one. Feeling pretty good about my chances. Yeah, that went reasonably well. Reasonably well. No half, no half, no half. I almost did it, chat. I was literally had my finger on my hotkey for Harvester. I was about to do it. And then I was like, no, we're doing no half. Oh shit, I think our opponent is doing no half as well. That's kind of scary. Nope, there's a Harvester, okay. Weird that he would retarget away from the one man wheel when he's playing scavengers. Like, don't you want to get the kill with the scavengers for the money? Isn't that how that works? Don't be chuggy, 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 don't be chuggy. chuggy. Alright, cool. Alright, nice. We actually have the money again. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe Nod is just so good that you can win the first missile without spending all your money. Like, with GDR, you need an MG to do it, but with Nod, you can just play Nod units, which are all insanely good and cost-efficient. And then you still have plenty of money. Alright, we can't beat a Chuggy, but that's okay, because we, we already have the first missile and the Harvester up, so... We will try and get a second Harvey Star. Yeah, that's really bad for me actually. This mutant is very, very bad for me. I definitely cannot kill a mutant. Not when it's protected by a chemical buggy. And that's gonna farm my harvesters. So yeah, this is real bad. Trying to use these wheels to fight the mutant. Ah, <laughs> uh, the classic counter to mutant wheel. <laughs> I think it's working as well, sort of. I mean, like, obviously we're going to lose the missile, but that's fine, right? We expect to lose the missile. As long as, as, long as the harvesters don't die, I'm reasonably happy. I suppose we'll be the avatar. Not at all. That's not good. That is very not good. So many mutants. So many mutants. Alright, we have Avatar. We can beat the mutants. Let's go, Avatar Warmit! That's one for the propaganda. Oh my god, mutants are so strong. Oh. Oh. No, that is not good. <laughs> that is really not good, boys. <laughs> Holy crap. What the fuck? He's like, Jade Missile, your avatar with two chemical buggies. Immediately make four more units that cost 60. What? This guy just had 240 lying around after the Jade Missile. Holy shit. Alright, there we go. We didn't get the 10-0. <laughs> that 
He literally went chuggy chuggy mutant mutant after losing two chuggies and using a jade missile and two mutants. Like I killed two mutants and two chuggies with my avatar and he jade missile. So that's 240 plus 80. So that's 320. And then he made another 240 of, of units right after. So that guy had about 500, 600 Tiberium when I built my avatar. Insane. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed the no half avatar nonsense. <laughs> Could not beat guy who had 1,000 Tiberium. <laughs> All right, I'll see you next time.